Hello again. Uh, once again, I just got back from swimming. Um, you know, over the last week I've been swimming quite a lot, and I've really improved. I can do about uh, 80 lengths in an hour and a quarter now, so it's good exercise, and I'm really feeling the benefits of it. You know, after a good swim, I feel really energized and relaxed and stuff. So I really enjoy going, and lane swimming is particularly good because it means no kids in the way, stuff like that. And there's also um, fast lanes, so there's, I can use different people as pace setters. But my breathing has improved a lot. You know, can uh, I do five or six strokes with my head underwater and then pop up for air? So it means I'm going quite fast, and I think that's better exercise. Maybe not, but you know, it does mean that my breathing and body are working together, which is quite good. Uh, this week did the form for the house that uh, we're potentially moving into so that will be sent off tomorrow but um, you know, it's really really is happening now we've set the move-in date as the 29th of September so that's a Saturday um, I'm back at uni from the uh, 23rd or 24th whichever the Monday is but so um, you know it's gonna be back at uni for a week then move out and try and carry on Quite easily, I know I've got a deadline when I go back straight away though, so I'm um, going to have to try and juggle those two. I haven't really posted too much this week, in fact only one post which is really bad of me, so sorry about that. Um, I don't know, it's just been, I haven't really felt like writing this week, it's been a bit weird. Um, I have been reading a lot though, been getting the times every day, I've now got a subscription, I can't remember if I mentioned that before or not, but I also now get it delivered, went to a you know, it's 30p a day to get it delivered, for I may as well ensure I use the vouchers every day. So, you know, I've been not reading it cover to cover, there's sections in there like business and stuff that I'm not really interested in, but reading the news section, reading the magazines, stuff like that in preparation for when I go to the Times in September, which I'm really looking forward to. Um, I kind of forgot I had it a little bit, well, I didn't forget I had it, I forgot the dates, because there's a student media conference going on on the, on the 10th and 11th. That I booked to go to, but you know that's when I'm at the time, so I can't go. So that was a real shame. It looked really interesting and had some really good guest speakers. So I'm a bit gutted that I'm missing out on that. But I think in the long run, the Times is a much, much more um, interesting thing to have on my CV. Um, uh, do, 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 what else? What else? Oh, um, really got into Person of Interest. Um, Jonathan Nolan writes it. You know, he's co-written the Batman films. And it's really good, really clever, kind of like Minority Report, um, iRobot kind of thing, I suppose would be its closest companions. But it's a really interesting concept and you know it's got me pretty gripped on how it works. Um, other than that, big news coming tomorrow. I said, not last week, the week before, that it would be coming a lot sooner, but um, they wanted to keep it not hush-hush, but under wraps till tomorrow. So that'll, you know, it's a big step for me in my career, hopefully. And uh, I'll let you know what that is tomorrow. I'll, you know, it's going to be up on a certain site and I'll, I'll post it onto this blog as well. Um, that's it, really. Uh, not really too much going on this week. The Olympics are finished, so not really much TV to watch. Um, football's back, but I'm not really too interested in that. Um, so, yeah, over the next week, big news tomorrow. Um, lots of stuff coming the week after then because that's well, you know, won't go into too much detail. But um, I'll check back with you.